Good morning and welcome to this week's Wednesday with Warbus. We're here at 219 North Lee outside the administration building. And today what I'd like to uh, inform you about is the workings of the Board of Education, our five member board that volunteers their time. So if you'll follow me in, we'll go to the boardroom. Here in the boardroom, we're lucky, lucky to have lots of good artwork. Uh, Kim Ferguson, the president of NBC Bank, sends Honey Marche every year to give the most recent uh, artwork that they promote every single school year. And as you can see, we have lots of nice artwork that's been donated by NBC Bank here in the boardroom. We do have a five member board and each one of those members comes from a different part of the city and District 1, which is James Patterson, he is in the lilac color, the purple color. Lee Veer comes from District 2, which is the blue right in the center of town. Stephen Barnett comes from District 3, which is the large green area. Kelly Duncan comes from District 4, which is the beige color on the north side of town. And John Thomas is District 5, which is all of the country uh, district outside of the city of Altus. In addition to our five member board, we also have an ex officio member, Colonel Lance Whitfield. He's a very important part of our board. He does not get to go to exec executive session and he does not get to vote, but he does give us lots of information during discussion uh, with the actual board. Uh, we also have uh, Lee Veer. He is the most recent addition to our Board of Education. He was appointed uh, last semester when Deborah Phillips uh, resigned because she moved closer to family. She had been a major part of our board for many, many years, so she was a great loss, but we have a great one with Lee Veer. He was appointed to finish out uh, the calendar year, and then he filed the first part of December. Board members always file the first Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday of December, and so he filed to uh, take Deborah Phillips's place, as well as Stephen Barnett, which is District 3, he uh, was up for re-election. They both filed unopposed, so we did not have to have an election in February. So those are two new members. Uh, Lee finishes out the term of Deborah, and Stephen gets a full five years. As I showed you earlier on the map, the uh, members must live within their district, but when it comes time for voting, the whole school district votes on those particular ones. So we have Lee Veer. Also, we have John Thomas. He is in District 5, which is, he represents the, all the county outside of the actual school. Kelly Duncan is our current uh, president of the Board of Education. Uh, her last month as president will be next month, and they will vote to see who becomes the new president. Stephen Barnett, again, went unopposed, so we have him for another five years. And then James Patterson, he is from... District 1. He lives in District 1. Uh, he's been a great addition and he's been a part of our board for two years. Karen Sanchez, she is the uh, board clerk. She does all the voting. The, her major job is keeping minutes for every board, mem board meeting. She cannot attend executive session unless she's invited and usually she's not invited. So a board member takes minutes during that time. I'm here with Lee Veer. He's our newest member of the Board of Education and I wanted to introduce him to you, uh, Lee Veer. And Lee, I just want to thank you for volunteering your time here at Altus Public Schools and serving on the board. It takes a very special person to do that and I know that you have our district at your best interest. Yeah. So just tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, good evening. My name is Lee Veer and I represent the District 2 on the Alta School Board. Me and my wife of 22 years, we both are Altus High School graduates, 1992. 
I have two daughters that attend Altus Public Schools. One is a senior this year and one is a sixth grader at the intermediate school. And if there's anything that I could possibly do to help in any way that I can, just give me a call at 580-471-7982. And thank you. We are very lucky here in Altus Public Schools to have such a great Board of Education that is very supportive of our teachers, supportive of our students, and wants, what, wants what's best for Altus Public Schools. Very thankful and very grateful to them. And I'm hoping you as the faculty and staff will reach out to them, get to know them, and thank them for their volunteer work because they are an integral part of Altus Public Schools. Many of you know that our board meetings are the second Monday of every month and they begin at 5 p.m. They are open to the public, so we encourage anyone to come at any time. Uh, the best part of each meeting is when we get to recognize the great works of our teachers or the great works of our students. So we'd love for you to come and be a part of our board meetings. And as always, may God continue to bless Altus Public Schools.